Welcome to the World Register Report. The World Register is an independent news source providing truthful, unbiased, and timely reporting of people, places, and events. Commentaries are also provided on selected stories from time to time. The Associated Press reports today that innkeepers, restaurateurs, and landscapers around the U.S. are struggling to find workers and are turning down business. They state the reason is because the government is now enforcing the law and limiting the number of H-2B visas issued to 66,000. The report states that resorts need foreigners to work as housekeepers, cooks, and dishwashers and say they cannot find enough Americans willing to take such jobs. It was not clear from the report why the resorts feel they cannot find enough American workers. At an inn in Maine, the owner reportedly states she cut back on the number of rooms available during New England's spring vacation week. She said due to her request for visas not being granted, she was short eight housekeepers who are paid 10 to 12.50 an hour. Each visa typically costs at least $1,000 in government fees, travel, and other expenses paid by employers. It was not understood why the employer could not find an American worker and pay for their travel expenses to Maine. Reuters News Agency reports that Indian information technology company Infosys Limited will hire 10,000 American workers and open four technology centers in the U.S. The report states that IT service firms, which traditionally rely heavily on foreign workers on the H-1B program, advise large companies on technology issues and help with managing back office computing systems to high-level programming. It was not understood from the report why the India-based company can find U.S. workers when companies in Seattle, Washington, or Silicon Valley seemingly struggle to do so. Breitbart News Network reports that the United States government issued a new terror alert affecting those traveling to Europe. The U.S. State Department said terror attacks in Britain, France, and Sweden are evidence of the Islamic State's ability to plan and execute terrorist attacks in Europe. The State Department added, terrorists persist in employing a variety of tactics, including firearms, explosives, using vehicles as ramming devices, and sharp-edged weapons that are difficult to detect prior to an attack. <laughs>